Chinese military is studying the characteristics of HIMARS weapons used in Ukraine. Among them are drones and which they could potentially encounter in a war for Taiwan. Russia's full-scale invasion of Ukraine is gradually escalating into World War III, which Moscow's allies, China, Iran and the DPRK could take advantage of. This is happening in particular because of Kiev's weak support from Western countries. This was stated by foreign affairs media outlet. According to experts, Western support for Ukraine has stalled since the start of the war. Their greatest fear is an escalation of the conflict, which is why they are limiting the use of their weapons in Russia. The situation has led to countries outside Europe turning to Russian President Vladimir Putin with diplomatic schemes to end the war, experts say. However, it will be difficult for them to take a neutral position, making Ukraine unlikely to agree to talk. Foreign affairs stressed that the war in Europe is gradually turning into World War III due to its gradual increase in scale. This could be exploited by China, Iran and North Korea, for whom participation in the war in Ukraine could help prepare for wars they may wage in the future. Experts shared that there is a rumor that the Chinese military is studying the characteristics of the weapons used in Ukraine. Among them are drones and HIMARS, which they could potentially encounter in a war for Taiwan. Iran also received Western technology captured from Ukraine, including anti-tank and anti-aircraft missiles, which it could study for its own production, experts said. North Korea could gain combat experience for its soldiers. Foreign affairs recalled that Europe has been waging wars beyond its continental borders for a long time. Now, Western countries have decided not to intervene in the conflict directly without sending their soldiers to Ukraine, which is a signal to Russia and its allies. However, non-European involvement in the war would not necessarily lead to Ukraine's defeat, the experts added. Foreign affairs said support from Iran, China and North Korea could come at a high cost to Russia and suggested that Moscow would have to make some concessions to strengthen its relations with these countries. Russia's foreign minister said Thursday his country is ready for a dialogue with the United States if such an initiative comes from Washington. It was not us who broke off relations with the United States, it is not for us to propose to resume them, but if there is an initiative to sit down and talk honestly, without any unilateral demands, about where we are and how we should move forward, we won't leave it unanswered," Lavrov said after meeting with Kazakhstan's foreign minister Murat Nertlu in Astana. Kazakhstan has been invited to join BRICS as a partner country with Brazil, Russia, India, China, South, he said during the talks with Nertlu. We hope that this will enrich our contacts on truly acute global problems in the era of change that we are witnessing and in which we live, Lavrov added. Мы заинтересованы в развитии многосторонних форм нашего взаимодействия, это и ОДКБ, Евразес, СНГ, ШОС. Казахстан получил приглашение присоединиться к БРИКС в качестве страны-партнера. Надеемся, что это обогатит наши контакты по действительно острым глобальным проблемам в эпоху перемен, которую мы наблюдаем и, собственно, в которой мы живем. Местных школ в России, в Казахстане, расширение сети филиалов. Не мы прерывали отношения и не нам предлагать их возобновить, но если последует инициатива о том, чтобы по-честному, без каких-либо односторонних требований, сесть и поговорить, где мы находимся и как нам дальше двигаться, за нами дело не станет. Some Italians and tourists on the streets of Rome had mixed reactions to the victory of Donald Trump in the U.S. presidential election on Wednesday. Standing outside a newsstand in the Italian capital, Ricardo Savoia said he saw Trump's surprisingly decisive win as a victory for the common people. 
I think that Trump's victory could have positive effects on the whole world, for example on the conflict in Ukraine and the one in Israel, he told the Associated Press. In Rome, another man who gave his name only as Fernando, appeared deeply concerned with Trump's win. I'm disappointed, what else can I say? Really, it is crazy and dangerous. Italian Premier Giorgia Maloney congratulated Trump on the win. Italy and the United States are sister nations, linked by an unshakable alliance, common values and a historic friendship. It is a strategic bond, which I am sure we will now strengthen even more, Maloney said. Vince Donald Trump, è lui il 47 presidente degli Stati Uniti, abbiamo fatto la storia, chiuderemo i confini ai migranti irregolari, dice poi il bacio alla moglie. Perché questo è il vero significato della vittoria di Trump, ha vinto la gente semplice, ha vinto il popolo, ha vinto la gente che ha guardato alle cose concrete. In Italia purtroppo noi vediamo che la situazione complessiva non è una bella situazione, il nostro governo sta cercando di porvi rimedio ma siamo ancora molto lontani e io credo che questa vittoria di Trump potrà avere dei riflessi positivi anche in tutto il mondo perché per esempio il conflitto in ehm, Ucraina e il conflitto anche in Israele probabilmente grazie a lui che ha una forza che altrimenti eh, Kamala Harris non avrebbe avuto ehm, potrebbero risolversi. dispiaciuto, nient'altro da dire, cosa dire, veramente, non... pazzesco, pericoloso. Io sono molto contenta perché ho amici, ho vissuto negli Stati Uniti e, e conosco quello che lui ha fatto e poi quello che ha fatto Biden purtroppo. Non è che io sia partidaria di un partito politico, niente, semplicemente abbiamo bisogno di persone che facciano bene le cose per il popolo. L'America ci ha affidato un mandato forte e... Mi dica in quale parte del mondo c'è la democrazia. Capisco che sono parole pesanti, però è sotto gli occhi di tutti. Dopo che la Fox lo ha praticamente dichiarato 47 presidente degli Stati Uniti. I think that um, Donald Trump is a lot stronger, uh, more aggressive president, which intimidates a lot of people. But at the same time, I think it also helps with.